In this video, I'm going to share my experiences on what it takes to be able to charge more for your animation videos. As an agency owner, I made the mistake of charging too little for too long until I learned how we could sell an animated 2D explainer video for $5,000 or more. This might sound like a lot and maybe even as impossible if you're selling on Fiverr or Upwork today, but it is possible to move up the price ladder if you know what you're doing. At the end of this video, you'll have a list of concrete things you can do to be able to charge more as an animation freelancer or agency, no matter where you are today. You might not know this, but my animation career started as a student marketing assistant where I got the task of finishing up a half-baked Beyond video. I knew nothing about animation and still I ended up becoming the video guy. After a year, I thought I'd try to offer my animation skills to the world. I first thought about platforms like Fiverr and Upwork, where a lot of people were already selling animation videos for around $50. After a bit of research, I decided not to enter that race to the bottom. I'll come back to why later. And I therefore started selling videos through a friend's website agency instead. When he sold a website, he offered a video for the front page as well. And if the client accepted the offer, I made the video. Later, I broke out and started to get my own customers. And I also hired my first helping hand on a per project basis. One year into that setup, we charged about $500 for a project, meaning script writing, voiceover and animation. During the next couple of years, we built up a strong portfolio of explainer videos, a base of satisfied customers and a skill level that gave us the confidence to approach larger corporations. At the time, before I chose to close down the agency, our prices were in the range of $5,000 and upwards for a complete enterprise project. Looking back, I see a couple of factors that made it possible for us to move up through the price ranges. My recommendations for you as an animation freelancer or agency fall in three categories based on what game you want to play. If you want to sell a lot of low priced videos on freelance platforms, you need to keep your cost down, which means choose a cheap tool. Although Beyond is the best animation maker out there, you probably can't afford it charging only $50 per video. Powtoon, Animaker and Toonly are cheaper alternatives that still get the job done, with Toonly being the cheapest. If you resell your videos on platforms like Fiverr and Upwork, you risk getting your account closed if you don't have your reseller rights figured out. For example, Beyond charges a per video rights transfer fee of $99. So that's out of the question if you only charge $50. Other tools ask you to upgrade to a higher plan if you want to resell. And to not risk having your seller account closed, you probably want to do that. It's going to be hard to build a sound business around a $50 per video model. It's a race to the bottom where clients choose the cheapest option with the best rating. That's why I recommend you work towards entering the next price range. To play this game, you have to realize that simply offering animations has become a commodity. Opportunity lies in helping with the complete video process. This means that you now help your clients with script writing, voiceover recordings, and animations. I teach all three disciplines on rootreese.com, but I'll happily give you the quick rundown here. Script writing is all about converting what the client wants to say into something much more concrete and information dense. Choose only a couple of core points to get across in your video and structure the script with a strong intro, an entertaining story and a specific call to action at the end. Voiceovers are sticky business, but the way I did it first was to find a handful of talented voiceover freelancers on Fiverr, favorite the best and work with them again and again. They deliver a recording and you have to learn to master and edit the audio to make it sound good and have the right pacing for an explainer video. Finally, you get ready to animate the whole thing and you already know how to do that if you've played the $50 game earlier. Although to step up your animation game, you need to customize the animation tools templates much more. You also go straight for the best tools out there. I believe it's beyond. Or at least you choose a tool and stick with it so you become amazing at it. Sticking to one tool also creates consistency in your portfolio. 
Your clients are going to love you for taking care of the complete process around their animation video, and they'll happily pay you $500 for it. Still, after a couple of years of doing this, we got tired of competing against other animation agencies who did more or less the same thing as us. I was ready to level up once more by offering something more, and this is how we did it. To charge $5,000 for an animation video, you have to do everything you've learned by playing the $500 game extremely well. You write super sharp scripts, you use amazing voiceover talent, you master the craft of sound editing, and your animations are engaging, fun, and support the voiceover elegantly. On top of all that, the $5,000 game requires you to focus on a few key assets. Over time, you build up a professional portfolio of your very best work, and you showcase this portfolio up front on your website, your YouTube channel, and on LinkedIn. This is your number one asset. In addition to your portfolio, you create a logo wall that showcases all the awesome companies you've created videos for. You've gotten loads of great reviews on Facebook, Google, and Trustpilot over the years, and now people start recommending your services through word of mouth. This is key to exit the competition on price only. When direct word of mouth recommendations happen between people who trust each other, price doesn't matter that much anymore. Now, when you get that contact and you finally sit down with the client, because that's often demanded when you charge $5,000 for a project, you need to demonstrate strategic understanding. It's actually a challenging exercise to try to boil all this down in this video because it becomes so overly simplified for better or worse. Anyways, to ensure the client that you are the one to invest $5,000 in, you have to show that you understand their business, where they're at right now, and what they want the video to do for them. Ask questions like, what makes you different from your competitors? What's the ultimate goal of this video? What do you want viewers to know and do after watching this video? They talk, you take notes for your script writing later. And when you get to discuss price, you don't just shout $5,000. You present your pricing model. Always have a model. Our model was a base fee of $2,000 for 60 seconds of animation, plus $15 per extra second beyond that length. On top of that, we offered to make the video in multiple languages, charging about $500 per extra language. This requires an extra voiceover and a little bit of timing correction of the original video, but it's a great value add for the client and for you. These moving parts of a pricing model makes it easier to get a higher price because it makes sense to the client that it all requires extra work. It's like a menu card and they order what they want. When the bill comes, there are no surprises because they chose what they wanted themselves. Congratulations, you got the sale. Now you do all the script writing and voiceover work. When it comes to the animations part, there is a final discipline you have to master. In the $5,000 league, you have to have serious brand guide proficiency. It's a term I just made up, but what I mean is that you have to learn to align everything in your animation video to the client's brand. This includes uploading custom fonts, applying exact hex codes to all colors, recreate shapes and objects from their design materials, and stuff like that. At this point, I hired a very talented animator full-time, who was a much better animator than I ever was. He enabled me to spend much more time with clients while he took care of all the animation work. This ultimately enabled the two of us to break the six-figure revenue mark before I decided to take my career in a different direction. To sum things up, the $50 game is won by lowering your costs, using cheap tools and voiceovers, only offering animation, which is heavily based on templates, and possibly run the risk of getting your account closed due to rights issues with the tool you use. The $500 game is won by offering complete animation videos, including all three phases. Invest in the best animation tools, great voiceover talent, and time in offering much more customization in your videos to build up a beautiful portfolio. Finally, you break the $5,000 mark by being able to challenge your clients on a strategic level. Your videos look super professional, maybe because you hired someone to help you, and they align with the client's brand. You have an amazing portfolio and beautiful logo wall of client companies that you don't charge an all-inclusive price. You use a pricing model that allows for upwards escalation. 
I hope my experiences help you move in the right direction and enter the game you want to play. If you got value out of this video and you only subscribe to one channel today, consider this one. Thanks for watching. Remember to take care of yourself and those around you.